I'm going to show you how to use it with Windows 10 laptop. There are two methods I'm going to use. The first is using the Wi-Fi setup and the second is using a USB data cable. So if you don't have Wi-Fi, you can use the other method. So let's start with the wireless method, Wi-Fi setup. Go to the printer screen, scroll ahead and look for the settings. Select network settings, Wi-Fi setup, Wi-Fi recommended, Wi-Fi setup wizard. It will display the list of Wi-Fi networks. Select your network and enter its password. After few seconds, it will connect to the Wi-Fi. Go to the start button and click on the settings. Select devices. On the top you will see printers and scanners. Select it. Click add a printer or scanner. Instantly it will show up Epson 420. Select Epson 4200 series. Click add device. Printer is ready. Go down and look for the Epson printer. Here we can see. So this printer is here. Select it. Click manage. Okay. Now you can print a test page. You can run a troubleshoot. All the details are available here. We can start using this printer for printing. If you scroll down it displays the scanner. And click open scanner. On this page we have to start the scanning. So select your printer. Source auto. File type you can select JPEG and then click on the scan icon. Make sure you place a page for the scanning so on the top scanner lid. To view the scan click on the view button. Here we can see the scan is transferred. If you don't have a Wi-Fi network then you can use the USB data cable. Connect one end to your printer and the other end goes to your Windows 10 laptop. Once you plug in the USB cable just go to any document you want to print. Click on the print button. Now click on the print. Select printer and click on the print icon. Here we can see it has printed. So this way we can do the setup of this printer using a Windows 10 laptop and then we can use it for wireless printing and scanning. Thanks for watching.